everybody, it's Paige, and today's video is going to be me dyeing my hair pink for the very first time ever, 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 ever. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy, and let's get started. I am really nervous for this video, and this is like quite impulsive. I don't really know why I'm doing this, but I've had these Wella Color Charm paint things for like months now, and I finally have a little break off of school, and for school I'm not allowed to have colored hair, so uh, I have a couple weeks off, so I think I'm going to, well I don't think, I'm going to dye my hair pink with the light pink shade, and this is like a pre-mixed thing. All you do is like put it in your hair, and wait 20 minutes and then you wash it out and then you're like good to go so this should be very interesting I disclaimer have known nothing about hair I did bleach my own hair a long time ago uh, but other than that I I don't know what I'm talking about so I will be showing you what I'm doing but I don't I recommend reading the instructions and I uh, I just don't only take my advice because my advice is not good advice. So um, this is like a temporary hair color, a semi-permanent hair color is what it's called. And it says that it lasts up to 20 washes depending on used shade and initial color intensity. And you can mix these with the clear shade to make them less intense. but. I don't have that so we're going full intensity. I don't know if I'm going to go all the way to my roots or not. We're just going to kind of like go with the flow and see what happens. Okay so I just put this towel over my Venom t-shirt which is not even mine and I didn't even see the movie so I'm a total poser but um, I just like threw on a t-shirt that I didn't care about. <laughs> so I'm just going to like, I have a mirror in front of me, I'm just going to like I'm gonna start on this side and then move on to this side and then I'm just gonna go with the flow. Okay, so it's one of those things here. Let's see if this is like satisfying or not. Not really. Okay, so I'm just gonna like freak. I'm like stressed. Maybe I need smaller sections. Okay, I feel like the towel is just making things harder so I'm not gonna use the towel. And I think I think, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Um, I think I'm gonna cut in half like that and then we'll see what happens. I look insane right now. I don't, you're probably supposed to wear gloves, but. I'm literally just taking this and like rubbing it in between my fingers and hoping for the best. It looks like super, super pale. Like, I don't even know like how intense of like a shade this is gonna be. So I have like the bottom like half of my hair done, but I'm trying to like decide how high up I actually want it to go. Okay, I'm actually, <laughs> I'm actually gonna bring it up higher to where like the bleaching of my hair stops. Oh my gosh, this is literally a train wreck. I really hope that I have enough of this. I feel like I need to work faster because this has already been on my hair for like a significant amount of time. So I'm gonna come over here now and split this in half. <laughs> My hands are freaking covered in this stuff. Well, it looks like I'm not gonna have enough. This has honestly been a complete and total fail. Okay, so I just twisted up my hair into little twisty things just so that it's like out of the way and I'm gonna go wash my hands now and then I will be right back. <sighs> All right, friends, so this was literally the biggest fail video I have ever done in my entire life. I have a feeling that I'm gonna need to run to Walgreens to buy another tube of this because I wanted the pink to go all the way up to like where my natural hair color is coming in, but I obviously didn't get that high over here. So um, also in the back, it's like only like this much hair is covered, whereas like up here, this much hair is covered, so I'm gonna probably need my mom's help to try to fix this, but the color looks like super, like barely pink at all, which is like 
nice like it's honestly like a lot lighter than I expected and my hair was pretty dang light like it's bleached and it had like I just used a, a purple shampoo last night so I don't know I guess we'll we'll see what happens but um now we have to wait we're, we're supposed to wait 20 minutes but it's probably it's been at least five minutes since I finished doing this so let's listen to some music the phone is so rude I was thinking about the fans. We were like okay, guys, so we are fresh out of the shower, obviously, and um, it's time for the semi reveal. Yeah. <laughs> this looks so bad. Okay, so I just brushed through my hair, and you can definitely see like a pink hue to like parts of my hair. Obviously, not like so much up here but i am going to go ahead and blow dry my hair and then see what it looks like and we will definitely be making a trip to walgreens to buy like five more tubes of this to try to save this hair okay now we're at target because we went to walgreens to get more of that hair dye and they didn't have any so then i decided to just try a different one but they didn't have pink in the l'oreal one so now we're at target to try to find the right one okay look there's two there's this pink and there's this pink. I think that this pink, pink is so much prettier, yeah. What is it called? Soft pink versus hot pink. Yeah. Okay, hello friends. It is currently the next day because um, this was a total fail. As you can see, like there's like the slightest tint of pink in my hair, but it's literally basically non-existent. So I went to the store to buy like four more bottles of this, but then the store I went to didn't have it. I went to Walgreens first and they didn't have anything actually. Um, so then I went to Target and they still didn't have this but I found a different one and I decided that trying a different one would probably be better because literally nothing happens with that one. So I've picked up the L'Oreal Colorista semi-permanent color and this is in the shade Soft Pink and this one says that it lasts four to eight washes where this one said it would last 20 washes but as we can see, um, and this one, these Wella ones were actually sent to me from Influencer a long time ago, and I never uh, had the opportunity to use them until now, so the pink one is I'm not a fan of, but now we're gonna try the L'Oreal Colorista ones, and I have heard really good things about these, so I bought two boxes just in case, so we don't run out. This is what the top of the box looks like, sorry if you can hear my dogs right now so we're just gonna get right on into it you put this into a dry hair you leave it on for 30 minutes and then you rinse it out with water and yeah let's let's try take two I will say that this one right away the product itself is a lot darker than the product in the Wella color charm paint so maybe that means that it'll stick a little bit better I'm not going for like a hot pink look or anything I just want like light pink hair so i'm just gonna squeeze this onto my hand and um probably should have taken off my scrunchie um and then i'm just gonna put it on in this is like so much darker than the other one okay so i have the pink all in my hair obviously this is a lot darker than what you saw earlier in the video and I did bring it up higher a lot more product came in this tube or at least it, the product went a lot farther I did end up using pretty much the entire tube I squeezed as much as I could out of there so I'm gonna go wash my hands I am supposed to leave this in for 30 minutes and then I will be back to show you the reveal once I've showered okay so as you can see my hair is now pink so um i went ahead and used the colorista semi-permanent hair color as you saw and this is actually the day after i dyed my hair and after i've washed my hair so this is after one wash it was a little bit more saturated in color than this yesterday before i washed it but it's still like 
My hair's still pretty dang pink, so um, I am very impressed with this product. I will say it's not the exact color that is on the box. Like when I see the, the pictures of like the before and afters, um, here I'll kind of show you. I, I just don't feel like that's the color that my hair turned. I feel like my hair is a lot darker and more like, like cool undertoned, but I'm still happy with it. I think it was fun and I definitely don't regret the decision. I definitely won't have pink hair for the rest of my life and as soon as this washes out I will be I'll, I will have satisfied the craving to dye my hair pink. I will say that this product worked a lot better than the Wella Color Charm and they're both in the shade light pink and they both seem to be very similar shades as far as like the ad, what the advertised shade so I hope you all enjoyed today's video. It was quite interesting. I I think it's fun if you have the opportunity to dye your hair. Um, I think it's like, I think it's fun, like I just said. Also, this does say it'll last four to eight shampoos. So um, I've already had one shampoo. Also, I did want to mention that it's the instructions say to wear gloves when applying this. And as you saw, I did not because I was lazy and I didn't think I had any gloves. But then I actually, after I did everything, I actually opened up the real instructions because I only just read the box. And then I, I opened it up and there's, there's not one, not two, but three pairs of gloves in here. So um, there is no excuse, please wear gloves and read the full instructions before you do anything like dyeing your hair with chemicals. Anyway, this video, I'm not really sure what this was. I just wanted to document the process of me dyeing my hair pink. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. I love you all so much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.